Many fans of the hit reality show Duck Dynasty wonder how Willie and Corey Robertson have managed to raise such good kids. In her book, Strong and Kind, Corey shares her time-tested practices for parenting and talks about character traits kids need to lead successful lives. Please welcome back to the 700 Club, Corey Robertson. Corey, God bless you, good to see you. Thank you, thank you for having me. You guys have a blended family, of course, I mean biological and adopted kids. Tell us about the whole gang. We do. Well, our first child was John Luke. He um, is 20 years old and he got married this summer wow. to Mary Kate and she's just precious and the answer to prayers and they are studying at Liberty University now. So oh, okay. they're away at college or in, um, it's just been fun. The, the wedding was beautiful and lots of fun. And then we have Sadie, who is 18, and um, people followed her and know her from yes, Dancing, with the, Dancing stars, with the Stars. And she made us so proud on that. And then um, Will. Will, it will be 14 next week. He would probably like for me to say he's 14. He's, <laughs> he's, he's almost there. He'll be 14 okay. next week. And um, he is, he, we adopted him when he was five weeks old. Aww. And then, um, I have Bella, and they are 10 months apart. So Bella was a little mm -hmm. bit of a surprise, but a happy surprise. And um, and she is just precious. And she and Will are both playing basketball. So basketball season just started. And then Rebecca. Oh, Rebecca. Rebecca came at, um, she came to live with us at 16. She's from Taiwan. Oh. And she came as an exchange student. And we just adopted her into our family. She's not officially adopted but right. she's ours in our heart okay. and she is 27 years old so she was the last one to come to us but our oldest okay mm -hmm. amazing well how do you keep them grounded how do you keep them from getting like these big heads because you know there's so much attention on your family why did you decide to write a book on parenting and did anyone help you yes my mom wrote my, wrote it with me chris okay. yes my mom's name is chris howard and she um taught me everything i know about <laughs> parenting of course and about being a woman being strong and kind and so mm. it was such an honor to write it with her and then willie contributes as well so throughout the book there's little parts snippets where willie kind of tells a story or gives some wisdom and um you know it was so much fun to do as a family you know yeah. willie and i um are a good team i think as parents and um and my mom is just you know, huge influence. How long in have you guys been married? 24 years. Oh, wow. Praise yes. the Lord. Thank Wonderful. you. We were 18 and 19. Yeah. We were just babies. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, it's been a it's been a great ride. Still going strong. <laughs> well, you advise parents to choose two character traits to focus on uh, when you're developing your kids. Tell us what two you and Willie chose for your kids. Whenever our children were little, I actually had John Luke and Sadie, and I remember this moment. I was at a Bible study, women's Bible study group, and someone asked, you know, what values are you going to instill in your children? Yeah. And I went home that night and I wrote down strong and kind, and Willie and I talked about it and we prayed about it. And, you know, we chose strong because we wanted them to be able to withstand the difficult times in life, the hard times that would come, be strong in their faith, know that God is with right. them, and that, um, know that that um, they are his, they are his children, and even when tough times come, and be, be strong with, with with peer pressure, the things that come their way, and then to be kind for others, to be yeah. generous and compassionate, and all the things that go along with kindness. Absolutely. So those were the traits that we chose. There's a ton of good ones, and that's the whole point of the book: is not to tell you how to raise your children, but to say, think about it. You know, be intentional about mm. what values you want to instill in them, and choose. What, what, which ones you think are important? Well, in your book, you write when you're in love with your children instead of your spouse, everything gets mixed up and goes haywire. What do you mean by that? I think that is so true. I think that parents you know, make that mistake a lot of time. They, they, they have this little bundle of joy and then they just, all their attention goes directly to that baby and they, they lose the attention with their spouse. And the absolute best thing you can do for your children is to love your husband or for, as a husband to love your wife and to keep that marriage intact. And um, you know, all the things that you teach your children about character can be thought, taught through marriage. Things like loyalty and humility and kindness and love and gentleness can be taught through a good marriage. So I think um, marriage is your number one priority. You gotta be in love with your husband. You do, and you guys do a good example of that on, on the show. Well, are you still having fun um, doing the show and writing? And I guess you do a lot of speaking. I mean, what what do you enjoy doing the most? I am. I really am having a great time. You know, God has just blessed us with so many opportunities, and we're thankful for that. And you know, we're gonna use our time, kind of, I guess, in the spotlight to um, proclaim His name and keep doing it. 
Well, Corey, you're doing a great job. We just appreciate you. And um, the book is called Strong and Kind and Other Important Character Traits Your Child Needs to Succeed. You're definitely going to want to get a hold of this. It's available wherever books are sold. God bless you. And thanks Thank for being here. Thank you so here. much. Appreciate it. Well, we'll be back with more of the 700 Club right after this.